No ma'am. No ma'am. Hi guys, my name is Kaya. Welcome to my channel if you're new and if you're not new, what's up? You already know what it is. I'm back again today with another wig review and in today's wig review, I'm reviewing a wig from Motown Trace. I actually got it from wigtypes.com. So I'm going to put all the information below that you need to get to the wig if you're interested in trying it out. This wig is very interesting because... I ain't never tried nothing like this before. So this is the Motown Tress Less Lace Swiss wig. Um, the style of the wig is like, it's not braided, but it looks like twist. Um, the finished length of it is 24 inches long. And it's like an easy, it says easy corn roll, corn roll style. I always said corn rolls. I didn't know it was corn, corn roll. But anyways, um, softer Swiss lace, ear to ear lace wig, no tape, no glue is needed. I got it in the color 1B. This is what it looks like. It does have lace on it, so I'm going to go ahead and cut this lace off. Y'all, when I saw this wig, I was instantly like, what the hell? When I saw this wig, I was really like, oh my god, what? what's going on? But, I mean, I'm interested in trying it. So, let me show you guys what... Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Y'all, okay. So, like I said, this is a wig, right? This is a whole wig. It's like twist, and it's going back. Like, you just got your hair twisted back or something, right? So, this is the front. The front has edges, okay? Now, when this is twisted back like this, please look at what this is looking like. This is like, I hope y'all can see this. I'm really hoping you can see this. Let me back up some, okay, maybe this will be better. Look at this. This is what this looks like underneath. It has like pieces of hair, like that's just been cut and it's left out. It's so weird. Okay, maybe this will be a better view. Look at this, do you see that? What is all of that? Oh gosh, I don't know if that's supposed to help it from being like, you know, from tangling in the inside of the cap or something. I don't know. It's really strange, but um, if you look underneath, so we have the lace front right here, as you can see, and how it's twisted back. And then you have combs that are like midways in the back. And then it has a comb in the back of it as well with adjustable straps. I'm not going to do with the adjustable straps, but you see how the back of it looks like? That's the back. It's just weird. The wig is just made weird completely to me, honestly. I'm going to go ahead and put this on, but I, I don't know about this, y'all. And also, somebody tell me, why is this wig shedding? Like, there's little pieces of hair on me. It's weird. Um, what is this? Okay, I feel like I need to take this off. Ignore my hair, y'all. I'm going to make this a little bit tighter because this feels kind of loose. I made it a little bit tighter because that wasn't working. That was too loose. And the reason I took the wig cap off is because I can't hook the combs since they're like back here. I can't hook the combs into the, um, the wig cap. No ma'am. No ma'am. This shit. Look at this. What is this? Oh no. It feels like this is so not secure at all. What am I supposed to do with this? I'm going to try and put these edges down. I'm about to get aggravated y'all. I'm about to get mad. That's what's really about to happen. If you ask why, it's because, one, when I have to put on edge control after I've done my makeup, it messes up my forehead makeup, and I hate that. But then this is also just, I don't even know, why did they create this? Real question is, is why did they create this, and why did I get it? I thought it was probably going to be like a little cute, but uh, this shit is disappointing. I'm like beyond disappointed. Just laying down the little bit of edges that they gave me. I'm being funny because they gave you hella edges. Like who thought this was a unique style? Now I'm gonna let them have that. This is a unique style. However, <laughs> it just looks, I don't know. I am not pleased. Here's a closer look y'all. Closer look at what's going on with this wig. Let me show you the back.
definitely not my fave. It's interesting. Maybe if I play with it or something. I don't know. Like, what do y'all think? I just need to hear what you say. I'm not pleased. I'm just going to be honest because it just feels like it looks really odd. And I'm not sure how you can make this look real. Like, I mean, I feel like it looks okay with this shadow that's going on with my camera. I'm getting closer so you guys can see, like, all detail. But, hun, mm -mm. it's just like, and it's so big. Like, y'all, literally, look at this. It moves with the easiness and I made it tighter y'all you saw me play with the adjustable straps I made it tighter but this is so this is definitely big head friendly because this is gonna come off my head I feel like this will literally just go on off like the quickness with the easiness the only reason it's not like sliding off is because I got the cones like stuck in my head I don't know Motown dress this was a disappointment and I put up another video with Motown Tress wig and that was a disappointment because the wig just looked like, uh, no. But, um, that's all I can say about this. I'm not pleased. I don't care for it. And it's a no for me in my book. Okay. Thanks guys for watching this video. I really do appreciate it that you watched it. It was a fail for me. A no for me. A no go. Zip, zip. No. But. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you aren't already and I'll be back with more videos and until next time bye guys oh heck to the now